Greetings, my friends. I told you last week that Donald Trump is setting things up for the Bible to be fulfilled, Scripture to be fulfilled, where men are eating, drinking, marrying, giving in marriage until the time that the rapture happens, harpazo or catching away, whatever you want to call it. <coughs> He's made it so the stock markets in America have risen 25% and around the world they're mirroring that. It's just been a boom for people to be able to do this and see Jesus is going to come back when people are doing those things and you can't buy and sell, marry and give, marry and give in marriage and party and have a good time when the world is falling apart and God has given us a tiny window I believe in using Trump possibly among other things to keep us ready so that rapture can happen and now twice now in two weeks Trump's done another huge thing to make it so we're ready. He's brought unemployment to a 50-year low a 50-year low to 1.8 percent and again people have jobs they're able to buy sell marry give in marriage and this unemployment boom of decrease is, is taking off across the whole planet as well. What America does the whole world does and follows behind us. It's always been that way. And understand, this is a very tiny window because all the financial experts say this, this is all a big house of cards waiting for one major event. They all say to a person that one major event will cause the end of all of this. It'll make it all fall apart and the world will go into total chaos, destruction, and horror. That one event, my friends, is the rapture, Harpazo catching away. It's the only event big enough to do it. It's upon us right now. God is just holding back until he's that last soul is saved, that he has that number listed in his in his mind, and then boom, like your eyes, that fast, the true bride of Christ, the babies, the little ones, even the unborn little ones, will be gone instantly. Most Christians will be left behind. I fear, sadly, because they won't repent of their sins unless they, they start repenting soon, and the graves will burst open wide. The loved ones will disappear. People will be dying left and right as passengers in cars and planes and buses and everything, it'll be hellacious. It'll be horrendous beyond your wildest nightmare. There'll be just the most terrible, awful, horrific, grotesque, fearful deaths imaginable where about two-thirds of humans will just die that way. And it'll just be a time of just weeping and sorrow, a time you'll be told you have to take a mark in your right hand or forehead if you want to be able to live, buy and sell. Take that mark you spend forever in hell in the lake of fire. Refuse it. If you're saved by Jesus Christ's precious blood, you go to heaven forever. But why go through all of that later? Right now you can be saved. If you've never been saved, you're backslidden. Pray the prayer. Do the six steps I have in the box below the video. No one's guaranteed more time in your life. If you'd like prayer, contact me. I pray for you every day without fail. True Christians, witness and pray for the lost daily. It's your job. If you're not doing it, do it now. If you are, great. And look up. Redemption draweth nigh. We fly soon. I'm being censored relentlessly across YouTube and Google. Share this video. May God bless you.